Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going over Q3 of the weekly contest 278. <laughs> Find substring with a given hash value. So this one's a little bit awkward, I think. Um, in the way that they phrase the problem, um, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord, especially if you like talking about, uh, you know, contest problems and just hang out and chat about daily problems and so forth. A lot of friendly, smart people there and me. Anyway, um, yeah, so this one, if you know your literature, you may recognize this as a variation of, not maybe variation, maybe just a different function for the Robin Carp. Um, let me type it out here so you could kind of, you know, Google it if you need. Um, yeah, and this is, uh, what, what do they call it? Mm. Uh, maybe just Robin Carp. I, I feel like there's a name behind this, but I forget. Um, but yeah, but the idea is that, it, I mean, it's a, it's a dubious version of Robin Cobb, only in the sense that, you know, there could be a lot of, uh, a lot of uh, collusions and stuff like that. And, and in this problem, you're trying to basically set up uh, for a substring that has that collusion. Um, one thing that I would say is that when I first read this, I, I missed the K part. Um, I, I missed that we have to find a length K. So I was trying to figure out how to do it with like prefix sum and stuff like that, or some variation of prefix sum DP. Um, I did, so that took me a long time, actually. That was silly. But anyway, um, yeah, so after doing that, you may recall that this is actually a way, exactly uh, the Robin Carp, except for the way that you may actually, you may normally write it is by putting the power in the other direction. So this is Robin Carp, if you, uh, one is that the power in the mod eh, may be a little bit dubiously chosen, um, but, and also is the string in reverse. So if you reverse the string, this is exactly Robin Cobb, except for maybe the power in the module is a little bit weird. Um, so once you recognize that, that's pretty much it. Um, the rest of the problem is kind of sliding window and sliding window and just Robin Cobb E out. So this is the way that I have it. I don't really have a great explanation for that. Oops. Other than that, to be honest, because, um, I mean, it, it is just like a, a thing that people know, but I think this is a little bit weird for a Q3 on a contest, to be honest, um, because Robin Cobb is not something, like specifically Robin Cobb, it's not something that I would have expected on Q3. So I imagine it's a little bit awkward, but it's something that if you do understand the concept of uh, Robin Cobb, you can prove it yourself. Um, and the code is very mathematical, so I'm not going to go over the code line by line per se, though we'll go over it a little bit better. Um, but basically, it's just Robin Cobb and sliding window, right? And then the idea is that, um, you know, so you have this formula, and of course, as you can see, ooh, as you can see from the index, I'm going backwards, like I said. So then uh, another way of writing this formula that we're given, um, I'm going to do it. Eh, I'm just going to write something like this for for now. Um, oh, oh, this is P to the first, right? That's what it's supposed to be. Plus dot, 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 right? Uh, the, I don't know, P to the K minus one, something like that, right? Um, so let's say you have someone like this. Um, the idea by, behind Robin Cobb that I, I try to think about is that it's um, it's almost like Horner's, right? I believe that's his name. Uh, let me Google real quick so I don't. Horner's method. Okay. Well, I was gonna say uh, rules, but uh, yeah. So this is Horner uh, in a way such that you rewrite this as z times p plus, uh, I guess in this case is y, and then this times p plus, uh, what's it, before y, x, y, z, so x, right, p, oops, dot, 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 right? So that's basically the way that I always remember Robin Cobb as a sort of kind of moving from left to right. And that's basically what I try to um, implement here. Um, this portion of the code is what this does, except for backwards, like we said, because we want the power to be on the, uh, at the end, right? And then here, this is just sliding, um, okay. Yeah, this is the sliding window part of it where, okay, so if if it is longer than length K, then we just slide it out. 
and this is where we have to offset is equal to this thing um, because after you do this enough times um, the Z you know just gets out right and of course this gets out when um, P to the K um, so you basically want to subtract this from the from the rest of this right from, from the rest of this number um, so that's basically the idea is that you have this number you know duh, 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 plus x duh, 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 dot 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 um so you have all this number right um and you want to subtract this out so that you can keep this within only k characters and that's basically the idea here keeping in mind that in python i, I it's much easier because i don't have to worry about over um yeah overflows or underflows or negative mods or anything like that so that's basically the idea here and then here we just check to see if it's equal to the hash value which is what the question asks you um yeah and of course this is going to be roughly speaking excuse me linear time uh because you just go from left to right and yeah and even the mod uh, even this you only do it once so this should be okay um and of course I just update best here because if this is equal and we're going from right to left, I said left to right, sorry, from right to left, uh, if you're going from right to left in a linear way, then that means that the earliest is going to be the first one. So then we just update it uh, constantly um, and then just return it at the way end. That's pretty much it. Uh, like I said, this is linear time and constant space. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'll say constant space. I mean, technically, this is a slice that allocates all of K memory, but depending on how you want to say it. But let's just say the algorithm is linear time and constant space. And then you could say the output is whatever. It's up to you to to, to phrase that in a way that you enjoy. But um, but yeah, that's all I have with this one. Let me know what you think. Um, you could watch me stop a live during the contest next. Like I said, the the thing that I got confused in the beginning was that I didn't know K was constant. So I was trying to figure out how to do like prefix sum in a way. But all the other parts I kind of got, or like I knew what to do, uh, though I still end up taking a little bit of a time. Um, but yeah, that's what I have for this one. Let me know what you think. And oh yeah, you could watch me solve a live during the contest next. Okay, it's good. <laughs> can can let it go. Okay, let's see. So you have some hash function. <sighs> First substring of S. Okay, so then that means that how do I get a prefix? Do, 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 do. PC. So it's just this is P0 plus one. And then when you shift to the right, that's a really awkward way of doing it, but maybe not. So you start at the end, and then you go to the dip. Let me restart at the end, then. Uh, hmm. I'll be very sad if I missed that. Nope. Uh, I'll, I'll be very sad if n square works, is what I was going to say. But uh, probably not. Right. What's power? Oh, it's just this number. Mm, let's see. So every time we add a new number, how do I also only get the prefix? 
People have gotten it though, so I don't. Maybe it's not that bad, but. Just go from right to. Hmm. Oh, did I miss something? Is this K is you go to? Oh, a flip. Wait. Oh. Oh, of length K. Okay, so this is just sliding windows. I am dumb. I I missed the K part. Okay. Yeah. Um. Okay. Ah, uh, silly Larry. So that's the ordinary of S of right minus of A plus one. Oh, also wrong. Okay. Um, Who am I doing again? Okay. Okay, let come on now, focus. Let's say do I want to do it this direction? Yeah, no, that should be right. Du -du 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 -du. And then when I go here I Did I mess up? Yeah, this is such a weird problem. Okay, first, because this is the lightest one. So this means that this has full innovation. The way I'm doing this kind of right, but the prefix part, not so much. That means that, okay. Um, okay, so, hmm. Um, uh, let's see. Oh, oh. Uh, just say uh, no. Power is a weird word. That, I think that's why I got confused. Power of k to the modulo. Okay. And then um, if y plus k is less than n, then can we subtract that from power uh, from offset? Index is equal to none. Mm, oh, good. Answer always exists. Okay, fine. Best is equal to right. Return s of right uh, plus k. Hmm. Oh, y is not right. Oh, p x is right though. Hmm, this is awkward. 
So this includes this and then minus this and this should be length k, right? Yeah, it should be right. Hmm. Oh, uh, this is this. And Oh, that shouldn't change this. I don't know why LE is giving me wrong answer. Hmm. I mean, that's not going to change the answer, but let's see. This is yikes. I probably should finish this earlier, but <sighs> let's see. So we're looking for zero. So this is one. That's right. This is right too. But why, why am I going the wrong answer? Oh, I'm dumb, am I? <laughs> okay, what a silly mistake. Hmm. Also, I compared this incorrectly. Wow, a lot of sloppy mistakes, but at least I'm not getting a... Actually, I don't want to jinx it. Uh, okay, let's give it a submit. Pending instead of you. Okay, there we go. Okay, a lot of silly mistakes. Yeah, thanks for watching. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Join me on Discord, especially if you like talking about these contest forums. I uh, hope you did well, and... Ah, let me know about what you think about this poem. Uh, stay good, stay healthy. To comment down, good. <laughs> no, okay. Stay good, stay healthy. To good mental health. I'll see you later. Bye bye.